beautiful On the 10th of May 2023, the Round Britain Cruise RBC60 came to Plymouth and we were there to record it. What are you recording for? Hello again. Yeah, I know, yeah. it makes such a difference. Are you enjoying it? the weekend so far? Certainly, well, we not are the weekend, the weekend. The weekend. Uh, yeah. Apart from the weather, of course, but look at it now, it's beautiful. Yeah, I mean, we had rain this morning, didn't we? And oh, it no. tipple, yeah, tipple, tipple, another day of rain, but tipple it's down. All cleared away. So, you, you went out socialising last night? Oh, we sure well, did. We did, yeah. and we're doing the same tonight. Yeah. Uh, you're going to Pier 2 tonight, are you? We're going to the Pier Mark. So it appears. Yeah. <laughs> so you went to the box last night, didn't you? Box, yeah. I the box was amazing, and we had a talk on uh, figureheads on warships. Yes. And a good animated talk by a real enthusiast from the box. Yeah. And, uh, you know, an enthusiast is what you need always for talks. Yes. He's full of it, and he, he said just enough, not too much. You know, and he, was, he kept the whole thing alive. Really, really good. Yeah. So what time did, what time did that finish last night? Mm, well, half past nine, nine ish, really. Yeah, yeah. nine to Bit half after past. nine, I think. Yeah. yeah. And so you're socialising at the pier two tonight? Yes. 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 Yeah. <laughs> go on a bit longer. It will. That's the hardest part <laughs> of your job, band. isn't it? The social, the social side. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> we've, we've got the amazing Calstuck rubber band. Right. And they're, you know. Do they bounce back? And not only are they really brilliant musicians, but yeah. entertainers. They yeah. are really, really good. Why do, they, why do they call them the rubber band? Because <laughs> they have got about 20 people in their band, yeah. so um, they're not always there. Right, okay. So, so it expands and contracts. Oh, right, okay. And when they've only got a few, yeah. they call themselves the inner tune. <laughs> that sounds, that sounds yeah. the sort of joke I'd come up with, actually. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So they don't get deflated? Don't get, sorry? Deflated. Oh no! No, they're really, really good, and they have a, such a lovely eclectic mix of instruments. They're going to be a harp. Yeah. And uh, all manner of wind, and um, you know, it's too many beans then. So it's a good old mix. Yeah. Yes. Really and the lady who runs it is an artist. Right. And okay. She makes a lot of mosaics. You'd be all artists tonight, won't you? Yeah. Drinking she... artists. Pardon? You'll be artist tonight, drinking yes. artist. Um, she she makes uh, mosaics that goes on walls. Nice she, one. Uh, under contract. Yeah. But she's done a big mosaic at Salt Ash. Right. Uh, she's done about three or four in our area. Yeah. She's doing an enormous big one in Carrington. And what's the name? Rosie Firak. Right, okay. Nice one. And what's the name of this boat that you're on? Harry Winkle. P uh, periwinkle. Well, this is periwinkle, yes. Yeah, we love it. Periwinkle, yeah. yeah. How, how old is she? We talked to. Uh, well, about she's her based on a late nineteenth-century inshore fishing boat from the Itchen Ferry area. Yes. So um, there's Bonita coming in. Right, ah, we better go and see where they're going. Right, okay. I'll catch up with you. Sorry. It's all right. Cheers. Thank you. It's, it's Benita. Mike, we thought you might like to go alongside um, Susan J. Up to you. Would you like to turn round first? Yeah, we'll do that. It's a long boat. Really long. <coughs> So you've got to... So if I can tighten the filter, I've got an air leak, so if there's any little gap anywhere, air gets in, gets in the fuel, it only needs a bubble. Yes. And then, you know, you've got a problem with diesel. It's a bit like the bloodstream, really, isn't it? You get an air bubble in the bloodstream, you've got a major problem. <laughs> yeah. So is it a big job, or...? 
So this is a little one-cylinder yes. Yanmar GM. So it's only got one cylinder to rattle around, so right. it needs to be really taken care of. No, so little tough little fellas, though. They're good. Yeah. An awful lot of small boats have got So these. it's like a lawnmower engine, really. Like a what? A lawnmower engine. Yes. A one-stroke. <laughs> <laughs> it goes dug, dug, dug. <laughs> yeah, nice one. Yeah. OK, hopefully it's not too big a job. Well, I hope. I'm just going to tighten it a little bit more, so, see if that works. Yeah. So are you going out today as well? Not today, no. Because no. some of the boats are It'll leaving be early tomorrow. because of the weather. Yeah. But we've given up on the parade of sail, sadly, because so many boats use this weather window yes. to scarper. Yeah. Um, because Monday, all hell is going to be let loose, so they need to be in a safe port. Hopefully they want to try and scrabble down to Falmouth. Yes. Because even that, the week after, is strong northerlies, and that's exactly it's, where the... It's freak conditions, goes. isn't it? So that's strong headwinds. Yes. So there may be stormbound in Falmouth for a little while. There may be there my... There's place, Falmouth. There's also Explore. Well, they've got the classic... They've got the tall ships oh, race there, there this are. year. Oh, yeah, yeah. So that should be interesting as well. Yeah, I'll try and go yeah, with the tall yeah. ships. Yeah. Yeah, we're that's getting the some... of the Falmouth working boat down there. Yeah. The oyster dredgers. And so, you know, and there are loads of them around. Yeah. There's a great maritime spirit down there. Yeah. Yeah. So how's your stay in Plymouth been this time? Well... It's been pretty good, really, but, um, you know, we've got the threat of the weather all the time and we've had so many boats delayed. We've just had another one arrive here this morning. Yes. And to Charlotte Elizabeth, and um, he's just one man and his dog sailing there. Yes, that's another story. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, what do you think of the weather situation then? Is it unusual? Well, the weather seems so, so unsettled. Yes. This is a real problem. We haven't... We've got a high pressure supposed to be coming in, but it seems a very skimpy one because it's dashing out again, it seems. Yeah. So... You just go with day like this. It's northerlies now, and yeah. both want to go north next week, and it's... You get a day like this, and you get false hopes, and then it changes know, back again. Oh, I know. Like this yesterday. Is you go out to sea thinking, yes, <laughs> it's all over now, yeah. here's summer. But. Yeah. <laughs> you used to be able to say it ain't over till the fat lady sings, but you can't say that anymore. No, you can't. No, at all. Thanks so much, anyway. Yeah. Enjoy your trip. Thank when you. When you go off again. Thank Cheers. you. Thank You're you. Doing a great job. Thanks so much for doing that. Special thanks to BBC Radio Cornwall, Plymouth Gin, Sutton Harbour Holdings, Jonathan Bryce, the Plymouth organiser, and everyone involved in the Round Britain Cruise RBC 60. 2023. 30 years of culture and the arts as a free service on Love Summertime TV. Don't forget to friendly share my videos, subscribe to my channel and support me through PayPal at ccsphoto1 at gmail.com. Thanks for watching the video. It's, 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 it's.